10 News starts right now. The family of a man who was shot and killed in a Walmart in Lauderdale Lakes is now suing the retail giant. Local 10's Roy Ramos has details of that lawsuit. We've learned that the victim was just here shopping with his family when he sees a woman being beaten. Now, his family tells me that he only intervened because no one was doing anything. Unfortunately, he lost his life in the process, but his family now says Walmart should have done more. The videos and pictures that we have. Makia Ford in tears as she remembered her boyfriend and father of their child, Theory Bastine. He was a great person. He was an awesome father to his kids. He loved his kids. It was in early May, Bastine was shot and killed by 21-year-old Tarani Sterling inside a Lauderdale Lakes Walmart. Investigators said Bastine was an innocent bystander with his girlfriend and their four-month-old baby at the time, who watched as Sterling got physical with another Walmart employee. He tried to grab her phone. When she resisted, he threw her into the shopping shelves. He threw her to the ground for several minutes and not a single Walmart employee did anything. Bastine tried to intervene when investigators said Sterling shot him six times. Even before the incident <clears throat> get out of hand, we had stopped and asked the Walmart shoppers to call security. Bastine's family is now filing suit against the Super Center, saying Walmart and its staff should have done more to keep their own employees and customers safe. We filed a wrongful death negligent security case uh, in Broward County Circuit Court for this family. Uh, we will bring Walmart to justice in this case. As Bastine's family now remembers the man who was trying to do the right thing, they say it's his actions that likely saved the life of a woman, sadly losing his own life in the process. There are nobody else, nobody else intervened. He saved her life. For now in Lauderdale Lakes, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News. Well, Local 10 reached out to Walmart. The company released a statement that reads, we are heartbroken over the incident that happened at the Lauderdale Lakes store in May and offer our heartfelt condolences to the family during this difficult time. We're just learning of this and are not commenting on potential litigation.